Thank you for joining me here at Think Museums. Today we are in Ghost Town, one of the several ghost towns here in Nevada. It's quite spooky too. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, so we're just checking uh, how the ghost towns used to look like. And. You know, the information that I'm getting is that uh, here in Nevada, there are over 6,000 ghost towns. You know, that's a lot of ghost towns, really. And what actually ghost town means, they are former mining boom towns that were abandoned when the mines closed. You know, some of them were set up as location for mill, milling, because they used a lot of timber to set up the frames for the, for the mines. And some of them are just supply points for, you know, for nearby mining towns. So they have almost more than 6,000, you know, ghost towns. You know, that's, that's crazy, you know. And what you need to know is that they're all scattered all over the state of Nevada. No wonder the state of Nevada is called the Silver State because they, are, they discovered a lot of silver in this state. That looks cute. You know, I just like the replica. They, they've created this to make it look like the real, real, you know, mining um, center or mining town or mining activity going on. Um, so that, look at that. That looks cute. Uh, so we are heading to an underground mine. It's just a replica. So we'll see how that looks like. I wonder who William Donovan was. So it's a little spooky, cold, airy, and the height is not that good because I'm first to you know, stoop, you know, as I walk. Um, but it's a little bit quiet here. You can hear my footstep. This is weird. Danger magazine. Yeah, there is a lot of um explosive in the mining operation yeah. but well we're not gonna see that it's just um you know an info to let you know that um they use that um on, as i walk here there are tracks railway tracks so they used to have those wagons that they load up with the iron ores or silver ores that were taken up and crushed so they had these tracks you can see these tracks here that were used to you know transport the iron ores, and also, I guess the miners will hop on it and carry it down the, you know, down the channels. But this is how it looks like. You know, I've never been down a, 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 a mine, and this looks like it was some real difficult labor going on here. Especially when you look at that time when they didn't have, you know, proper equipment you know, tools, you know. Right now, mining is a different kind of, it might be labor intensive, but they have the right tools right now, you know, the right equipment. They, they discover a lot of good things to enable them go down there and bring all those precious metals. Also, one more thing that I noticed um, in the mines is that they use a lot of lumber as a frame, so they don't, um, so that it doesn't collapse on them, you know. That's why when you travel in Nevada, you see that um, most of the hills, they've chopped a lot of the trees. So most of the hills are bare, they don't have any trees. So if you see that, and I guess this is how it, the mines used to look like, they were very dark. Whoa, that looks like something that was crashing. Yeah, actually it's an abandoned drift. So you can see there's a candlestick there that was used by the miner as he was working. So when they, some of them, when they crash, this lumber, they really help to, you know, to prop the, the mines, at least for a little bit of safety before they're able to run out of the mine before it crashed on them. Well, guys, uh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, support it, share it, 
and critique it and give me suggestions and what you want me to you know cover in my next videos um, most of the time I try to bring things like this uh, historical historical cities uh, museums art events so you'll be seeing more of this um, but right now we are in one of the abandoned not really in one of the abandoned mines but we are in a replica of how a ghost town used to look like or how a ghost town looks like basically they're just abandoned minds so th they might be scary because a lot of things happen down there you know a lot of deaths that happened so you can see how it looks like yeah a lot of lumber used to prop these mines mm. they have some old kind of equipment here too but I, I guess when you go to a mine right now, you'll be surprised at the kind of uh, tools and equipment they're using right now. Well, this is old. That's an air compressor. Mm, that's an old one. Wow. Yeah. So you can see all this railway truck running around here, deep under the belly of the earth, just ready to transport all the iron ores and the silver ores or whatever ores they are finding down there. Yeah. Well, guys, thank you guys for joining me. I uh, hope we see each other on the next uh, episode that I'll be covering. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss on any of my activities. Yeah. Thank you, guys.